Hi, Tommy Cowett, the real alien Tom from Outer Space Landscape here with you on a beautiful day. And today we're going to be installing a patio uh, out of paver stones. Basically, these are stepping stones, 16 by 16 inch. But I want to show you what we've done here in the past on this uh, area. If you could see down here, this is the old colony style paver. And the client here is constructed out of these stones and an edger. And we've done quite a bit of work in the same scheme where we are, we've actually done our whole driveway. We use uh, six by six treated uh, timbers around the edges and then there's an edge put in. And you can cut it into a uh, cut out some when you get to a uh, uh, angle but it all has to go in pretty much square. That's the way the system is designed. It has to be square. But we've done a lot for, and now I can tell you it's unfortunate, but the colony paver stone is no longer being manufactured. It was being manufactured by Newcastle, and uh, it was actually available here. So I think what we're, we're putting in a grilling patio for this grill to accommodate the grill. And here's where the extension's going in. Um, this is just setting it up to see how it's all going to fall into place and I've excavated out the edges uh, one of the things the reason we have to take it down to this level here is you've got that vent so the surface of the patio must be below that and we're gonna step down a couple of times and I'll go over this with you about how we install these uh, timbers now on the lower base we're only gonna need a 4 by 6 no need to put in a 6 by 6 when you get down to the bottom that's a four by six. Let me take you down here and show you the materials that we're going to be using. There's some other landscape projects we've done in the past here with stone steps. That's crab or orchard stone there. But uh, these are our six by six material. These are our stepping stones. The color matches really good with the color of the pa colony pavers we've got. And we'll be laying them in this paver base this is just crushed granite basically granite dust some people call it paver stone paver base um, basically that's uh, gonna be the base we'll pack that real well got the materials here on the truck so uh, that's what we'll be doing today and we'll check back with you in a little bit after we get uh, some of the lumber being cut All right, so Tommy Cowett, the real alien Tom from Outer Space Landscape, back with you. And we, uh, as you can see, have framed up the patio. Uh, we actually used some uh, deck screws, three and a half inch deck screws, to join these four by sixes up here. We're using six by six material. We want to keep everything on the level, not necessarily flat level. This will slope off down that way to accommodate some water and drainage that's going to end up there. But as you can see, we've laid in our paper base and tamped it really good. I like to tamp it with a rake and then come back and sometimes use these uh, large 6 by 6s or even this little guy right here. As I go along, I'm using that block to tamp. And we're just going to end up, so let's continue on. We've got two stones in, and we'll just go all the way around. We've got 25 block to lay. This should go pretty easily.
Okay, so here we are on to building the steps using a drill with three and a half inch screws. And I've laid the paver base in and I'm just getting a great level on that, tamping it down. And we'll have some finished built steps here. So I'm laying these four block in and going up the steps. All right, Tommy Cowett, the real alien Tom back with you from Outer Space Landscape. And it's the end of the day. We just completed the job. I'm just gonna take you up there and show you the finished patio. Now Lori has a patio for grilling. Because her grill was down here in the ivy. In the ivy, yeah. And now, we also put in that little raised bed there today. But that's it. That's all it is. It's block and tuba and some lumber. And you can really make a good surface. All right. Signing off. Have a great one.